Hey, -o. hope everyone's having a great day. Um, this is an important day in my life and the purpose of this video is to reintroduce myself to the world. So I'm Steven Sentez. Many people also know me as the visualizer. Um, a few months ago, I had a spiritual awakening and I made some content that I mostly put on YouTube. And one of the videos was really um, about who am I, which is an important thing for everyone to try to figure out. And at the time, I listed off a bunch of like characteristics, like I'm kind and generous and funny and smart and all that. And while all of that is definitely true, um, I've been on a journey of self-discovery um, for my entire life. And that's intensified in the past year. And I've come to different conclusions recently. So I wanted to share that and I wanted to share kind of what I'm going to be doing going forward. Um, so who am I? I am the embodiment of love and light and you are too. That's something that I'll explain in more detail in the future, but just know that that's true for all of us. Um, who am I moving forward? I am a spiritual leader. That is my calling now. Um, I've been called by God and given authority to spread um, my talents, gifts, and wisdom out to all of you guys um, to help uplift your lives. So that's what I plan on doing um, with a lot of my content. Um, again, I wanna stress um, that God comes first in all of this. Um, if you're uncomfortable with that, that's fine because it is a taboo topic. Um, but I believe and trust in something greater than I, something that created the entire universe that is uh, a God of good and that he ultimately wants good for all of us and wants us to live our best lives. That's the most simple distillation of God or the creator that I've come to acknowledge and understand. Um, I resonate with the Christian God um, the God of the Hebrew Bible, mainly because it helped me understand his characteristics and how we are kind of meant to live our best lives. But that being said, I reject Christianity outright and I reject all of the world's religions. I don't believe in any of their practices or rituals or belief systems or anything that they hold people accountable for. I think that they're misleading a lot of people, both intentionally and unintentionally. And I have, um, I have nothing to preach. Um, so what I'm aiming to do is to show and share my experiences and testimonies with you and then let that resonate. Um, I'm not demanding anyone do anything at this point. I just want to show you what I've found and what has worked for me, um, particularly in the past year that has resulted in a dramatic change in my life for the better. Um, so... I still have a lot of the same passions, so this is not going to be, this is not turning into some religious or spiritual um, channel wherever you find this video, because I'm going to be posting it in a lot of different places to extend my reach. I still love a lot of the same stuff that I used to, so um, you're going to have to put up with my awesome um, fake skate videos and my, my wrestling uh, clips and all that, and all that, that's, that's part of me um, that will never leave. Um, so I want to assure you that if, if you're following me for that um, and you can um, put up with everything else that comes along with the package, I love you. Keep rocking with me. If not, if this becomes too annoying, it's been a, a cool ride and I'll catch you on the flip side. So what I offer to you are um, invaluable gifts and there are two of them. So I offer you wisdom and more importantly, I offer you hope and I'm not going to charge anything for these. This is information that I've paid so much money for and spent so much time cultivating, especially over the past year. I've learned from so many mentors and gurus and gone down so many rabbit holes in books and YouTube videos. And I have a unique gift where I can process a lot of information and I can distill it down to more simple concepts that people can understand. That's one of my talents. It's always been one of my talents, kind of a training mindset. So that's what I plan on doing with a lot of content moving forward is I have a lot on my mind. I have a lot written down and I am out here to share it with the world and I don't really care how it comes off because I know ultimately it's going to help a lot of people. And then there are also going to be a lot of people that are triggered that reject what I have to say because it's going to unearth some hard truths um, if they really kind of think about it. And I'm fine with that. The chips are going to fall as they may. You can't please everyone. That's an important lesson to understand in your lives. And you also can't get bogged down into the fear or worry about what other people think about you. So people who know me know that 
I didn't really care a whole lot about that before, but I did have some insecurities deep down about kind of expressing my most authentic self. And those are gone as of today. So I'm going to keep it as a hundred as I can moving forward. Um, this is part of me. It's a huge part of me. It's been, you know, the results of a lot of hard work and introspection and uh, guidance by, by God. So I'm still a work in progress. <clears throat> I'm not better than you. I still have a lot of personal growth um, ahead of me. I'm going to do big things. Uh, I'm, I'm already calling my shots for that. Um, but I'm not perfect. I never will be. I'm going to make mistakes. I may share some information that ends up not being totally true, but it may, it's probably going to be a stepping stone for you and, uh, and certainly I into kind of understanding a better truth. So just get ready for that. I'm just, just wanted to put that out there that, yeah, um, I'm not a hundred percent, um, true on everything. Truth is subjective anyway. So yeah, my main calling and the message today is that I am here to help you make believe that drastically changing your life is very possible. I've done it. If you are not satisfied with how you're living right now and you have this sensation or urge deep down that you, there's more out there for you that you deserve better, there is. I was there six months ago. Um, I hated my life. I hated what I'd become. I worried that I didn't have many days left. I looked at the world and just saw cold violence, everything that I hated, and I, I lost hope. Uh, I figured that we were gonna be eaten up by climate change and or just violence or war. And I've learned to flip my mentality and, and see the beauty in life. The reason why you haven't attained the success in your life that you dream of is because you are your own worst enemy and you're in your way right now. So what I hope to do is show you how I got out of my own way and how I've just ascended um, in levels of consciousness and um, abundance and happiness and peace. So anybody that's rocked with me to this point, I thank you so much. I love you. You've all taught me so many lessons and got me to a point where I'm so comfortable in my skin. I'm sharing my authentic self with you. And I hope one day that everyone um, can feel the same way and they can really put themselves out there because there's a lot left to live for. And I, I hope you uh, walk with me and uh, get on this journey to uh, attain what you deserve in life. So thank you so much. I will talk to you later. Peace.